We have too much work that I, it's easily to set. We cover mainly three different areas. One is the social and medical assistance for the, especially the elderly Jews in Romania. The second is taking care of the Jewish heritage we now have. And the third is keeping up a public life and political life to protect the interests of the community. So these are the three largest aspects. And each care is sometimes it's easier, sometimes it's more difficult, sometimes it's better, sometimes it's not. So in some parts of uh, Eastern Europe, for example, in Hungary, uh, in Poland, uh, there are there's a lot of problems with political extremism, specifically from the far right. Tell us, is, are there uh, problems with anti-Semitism in Romania? Uh, if so, where it's coming from? Well, truth be told, we don't have, we don't have thank God, those kinds of problems in Romania at all. We do have some problems, nothing is perfect. And to quote the president of Romania who met last week with Benjamin Netanyahu and Perez, the main problem is Romania is not admitting that Holocaust took place, but you know, reconciling with it. We did have a nasty problem a few, maybe two or three weeks ago, where a strongly anti-Semitic uh, carol was broadcast, broadcasted live on national television. But thankfully, we moved very quickly and we had political backing and the problem was resolved very quickly. Other than that, we, we do have some issues, but the far right in Romania is very, very weak. We have a very good relationship with the government, all governments, so they tend to do a pretty good job. Not perfect, but anyway, no government is perfect, but the government works very closely with the community and they tried. This government, the previous one, so they, they pretty much keep the things, uh, they keep it in line. So what do you think um, marks the Romanian uh, political climate uh, as different from, let's say, for example, the Hungarian climate or even Poland, Ukraine? What, what marks it as different and therefore uh, friendlier to the Jewish community? Well, look, there is a political answer and there is an honest answer. I will begin by saying the political one, which is it's good to be in a good relationship with the community because Romania by tradition has an extremely good relationship with Israel. So from that point of view, we've always pretty much enjoyed, if not a very good relationship, at least, you know, not a problematic one. But mostly, I think that the good relationship we have with politics is because of personal relationships. Usually the, the current president of the Federation, Dr. Aurel Weiner, and the previous presidents of the Federation have enjoyed very close personal relationship with the top political life. So like in everything else, in business and everything else, having a good relationship, personal good relationship, usually extends to the community. And also, you have to realize that Romania had a 700,000 Jew strong Jewish community before the war. So many of these, the top politicians were raised up either close to Jewish homes or in Jewish homes or stuff like this. So they have good memories. And Jews in Romania have had an extremely large contribution from culture to politics to, of course, economics. And uh, we try to keep it.